You know, for those who spent time in Dubuque's Finley Hospital over the past year during the pandemic, doctors, nurses and staff taking a moment today to honor them and their experiences during the COVID pandemic. Let's go live in the studio right now to KWW reporter Danny Miskell. Danny, you had the privilege of attending the ceremony today. Ron, Finley Hospital gathered to reflect on this past year's experience of working through the pandemic. The ceremony opened with short remarks, followed by a moment of silence for 52 seconds to honor the 52 patients who lost their battle with COVID-19. White flowers are on display as a front centerpiece to honor those who died this past year. The nurses and staff members also holding yellow flowers for those who made it through the virus. For everyone at Finley, the most important part of their experience was caring for the patients. And in the words of the chaplain, Claudia Dorsch, they will never be forgotten want those that have entrusted us with their care and their family members to know that we continue to think about them and we continue to keep them in our thoughts and prayers. A total of 310 yellow flowers were in the ceremony, each one representing a patient brought to Finley and then discharged. And I was able to speak with the nursing staff manager afterwards. She said many of the patients who were able to go home after their treatment expressed how much they missed being at Finley Hospital because they developed such a strong bond while they were there with the nurses. And for the nurses, that was the most comforting thing for them to hear from the patients. Ron? Yeah, Danny, thank you very much. What a ceremony there today. And by the way, uh, Unity Point has been heavily involved in all of this. Now, St. Luke's Unity Point Cedar Rapids Hospital, as we told you, also held a memorial this week that we covered. Unity Point Allen Hospital in Waterloo also plans to do the same, and that uh, will take place at Allen, Unity Point Allen in Waterloo this Thursday.